What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Show of hands, the blaze again. Forgetting his hat. <clears throat> Welcome you back to Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth, to which we are going to do a couple of memory emissions. Yeah, sure, bro. Oh god, a cutscene already? Well, hello there! Are you the new guy at the Kurumi Detective Agency? I'm the owner of the Chinese restaurant. The past few days, the AC in the Broadway building seems to have gone out. Can you feel it? It's too hot, right? Ain't that weird? The air conditioner is on, but it's still so hot. The thing is, this is a problem throughout the whole facility. The other restaurant workers say they won't work now. I'm in a real bind here. I'm losing customers over this, and more and more and more and more and more people are renting. Everyone's being such a fucking cunt. Ugh, raving about the heat and all that. Oh, shit, I said the C word with it. Oh, whatever, I'm not monetized anyway. Uh, my daughter's at that rebellious age. Won't talk to me, comes home late, and then there's that stupid boyfriend of hers. God, if he didn't have such a big... I, <clears throat> Sorry we're off talk back there. Let's get back to the issue at hand. So recently, a repair guy came out to take a look, but he said the strangest thing that there was no problem at all with the AC. So when I went to try and talk it over with Kyoko, she said the new detective can figure it out. Do you think you can figure it out? Well, I think she tries to pin all of her problems on me, but, you know. Oh. That time it got suddenly cold in the building. That was you? Wow, guess I can rest easy now. Anyways, think you could take a quick look at the AC? Much obliged. Yeah, sure, I'm your electrician. That reminds me, sometimes you can hear a strange noise coming from somewhere near the K-Cafe on the fourth floor. Ah, that's probably nothing. So... To the, the fourth floor it is. Woo! Do 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 Um, I've never been back here before, but I'm not going to ask whether there's a random child back there. Uh, huh. Well, where the hell is the K-Cafe? Uh, guys, is there something going on in here again? Eh, I heard from Kyoko that you guys found that old vacuum tube computer inside this very cafe. Who ever thought you'd find it here? Well, I ever dig it out? Good question. Maybe there's definitely a certain allure to unearthing old treasures like that. Yeah. And it's also just no nice knowing it's there too. That's what not gonna know Broadway's all about after all finding rare gems. <laughs> okay. Um Well, since this is where they said there was a weird noise, I'm guessing this is where I'm supposed to be. I hope. Okay, a couple of Bonamon. Let's murder them.
This is what the game is about. Murdering babies. Wait, nope. That could sound bad out of context. I mean, I'm not wrong. Uh, I just got a text message. What is it? Terror Tornado Mofo. Uh, I hope this is the right place I'm supposed to be. Because, I mean, last time there was a Frigimon making it too cold, so... Does that mean there's going to be something this time to make it too hot? I mean, probably, right? Oh, hey, look, a Marimon. It's one Marimon. This should not be an issue. I love to say the word damn it on YouTube, damn it. The Digimon that caused this doesn't seem to be around. Let's t go tell the client. We just murdered a, an innocent Digimon. Ah, it's you. It looks like the AC is fixed. Were you the one who fixed it? Huh? There was a Digimon? In the AC? I don't really understand, but thanks, you really helped. Here's a Pokemon. Hmm, isn't it a little cold around here? That's right, the AC isn't working properly. It's been heating up. So I've been turning the heat settings down everywhere in the building. So the AC was fixed and suddenly it got cold. I freaked out and switched to the original settings. It's okay, it'll go back to normal soon. I'll tell the other stores that the air conditioner is fixed. Thanks so much, I'll send the payment to your office. Next thing we know, we come back and Kyoko's just rolling around in dollar bills and she, in the nude at that, and she just kind of looks back at us like, what? Want to join? <clears throat> Great work. I don't even remember. I don't think that was her voice, whatever. What do you say? Pour you a cup of coffee for your trouble. No, thank you. I'm gonna do this other mission, though. I lost. Again. If I don't find it, I'll die. Help! Click. <laughs> Click. Okay, I'm sorry. That could be. That could be looked at as he's like censoring his own language. Help! Click. Ah, nah, fuck. Nah, me. Fuck, fuck, click, bloody fuck, clack, clack. Uh, where is he located? Broadway. Uh. Uh. 
So how do I help a random Digimon? When I don't know where it's located. Nah, I'll try the gacha games later. Uh... Oh, okay. <laughs> Meanwhile, with that guy just over there staring like, what the hell just happened? You're the guy who took the case. To tell the truth, right now, I'm not feeling too good. I'm probably just about to die, so I don't know. One of the cogs that makes up my body. I lost it somewhere. It should be somewhere in this dungeon. Please, bring it to me as soon as possible. Tell me what you want. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, somewhere in this dungeon with what looks like eight different places to go. Sorry, bud, you're gonna die. Oh. Uh. Uh. Huh. Wow, these things attack a lot, don't they? Well, shit. Oh, did I kill one? I did kill one. And almost killed that one. Ninja bird! <laughs> well, that thing's fucking dead. So we just started fighting champion Digimon, like, that, yeah, that just went from zero to a hundred real quick. Oh god. Oh god, Terriermon, or Gargomon, finish him. Oh, oh god, hopefully, uh, Stingmon can come in and finish this. Okay, so that just happened. Huh. I... Good thing this was here to help me save, or help me heal. And I think I'm also going to save, because, uh... I won't need to die to a random champion Digimon and have to restart all that. Why is Stingmon in whatever? I don't care. Alrighty. Uh. Right. This is a fucking maze. No wonder the dude couldn't, uh, oh, didn't we just, hi, uh, huh. Ha. Ah, you found it. Quick, insert it into my b -b 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 back. Like that knife. Wait, what? So I'm still alive? Great, just in the nick of time. Over 
done for if you hadn't helped me. Thank you. You are a lifesaver. Cool. And since we're not teleported back, why don't we just keep looking around here, you know? Plus, this looks like a really good spot to grind. So I wonder if I can find any, like, items or anything. Uh... Huh... I feel like this thing is an ultimate level. Oh, well, I'm doing damage to it, so... Some damage. Yeah, that did nothing. Why? Why would you waste- I don't get why they waste their attacking turn to heal. <laughs> I was gonna say please heal Stingmon, but what- why? Guys. Come on. If Stingmon just attacked this thing, we'd win. See? Stingmon? Thank you. Stingmon's the only thing that can probably kill him. Ah, oh, fuck. Why wouldn't you just go for the other move? Well, Andromon's fucking dead. Frankly, I think I should not even care if there are more items around. Yeah, I'm not. Deuce. Though, like I said, at least that seems like a really good area to, uh, you know, train. Granted, not successfully, but better than here where it'll take forever. Great work. What do you say, Martin? No, shut up. Nobody cares about your coffee. So, I imagine you want me to go to Shibuya now? Is that what you're telling me to do? Guess to Shibuya it is. Um, why is there some woman standing in the middle of the... Hey, what's cooking? Good look at... Oh, you're... You, oh, actually, you might be good looking. Why does nobody pay attention to me? They never notice me. Not one person. But woe to thee who finds the entrance there. Uh... For if you make it, you only meet despair. <laughs> Nerd. Nani? I should see if there's a new case to investigate.
So we come here to Shibuya, meet a ghost girl, and you instantly want to go back and see if there's a case. Bruh? Come on, at least explore a little bit. That seems like an interesting name for a K-pop group. Oh, I can go in here? So oh, there's nothing in here right now then? Right, there's a door. I cannot go in that door. Yeah, so there's literally nothing in here. All right. Kiwimon. Back in Nakano. So you're the president of the Inoden Occult Research Club, correct? She cutie. That's what she is. <clears throat> yes, my name is Mei Gokusho. Alright, what have you got for us today? Well, I was wondering if you could help run an experiment to test an urban legend and see whether it's true or not. Uh-huh, I like the sound of that. It's not something we get around up here every day. Anyway, what legend did you have in mind? Well, it's called Shibuya Hirosaki, and it goes like this. At the Shibuya Scramble intersection, there are five hills, each of them going in a separate direction. You split five different people up, one on each road alongside those hills. Then you have them all head toward the Scramble intersection as they sing the Hirosaka song. If everyone makes it to the center of the Scramble intersection at the same time, right as they finish singing, what, do their wishes come true or something? No, a dead person is brought back to life and kills everyone. Uh... Huh. Can't say I've heard that one before. Reminds me of some old Shinto stories. I can see what makes the legend so appealing, though. You have to make it to the center through that constant crowd all while singing. Pulling it off sounds like no mean feat. Indeed. We tried it at the club several times, but we always either bump into people or get held up by a traffic light. But we've heard rumors about your organization, so I thought I'd see if you could help us out somehow. Rumors? Like what? Oh, like there's a detective agency in Nakano dealing with in the occult that has a supernatural ties to another world? Hmm. If you go to it at 2.22 a.m., there's a door to the other world that shows up and stuff like that. Geez, I know we work in the shadows here and all, but to think we're so infamous as to be having people make up urban legends about us. Wow. D don't take it the wrong way. But still, if we could prove that legend is true, it'd be... <laughs> it'd be a real boon for my club. But what do you think? I know your main work here is hunting down ghosts and spirits, but will you do it for us? Wait, what? Hunting down ghosts and... Where do people even come up with this stuff? No... Now you've really got me curious. Well, my assistant doesn't know a thing about it. Yeah, I don't know where I heard it either. <laughs> Silly me. Don't worry about it. We'll take up your case. We need a little time to get ready. So could you wait for us elsewhere here in the building? Oh, thank you so much. I have other members coming too, so I'll just wait outside for them. That girl's fucking nuts, but she's kind of hot, right? I mean, looks like we got another weird case on our hands. 
but okay, so this is a case. What are you going to do? I'm going to start preparing for our Shibuya Hirosaka experiment. Why don't you go talk with the other club members and learn more about the legend? That sounds like a fantastic idea, Kyoko. We still have a few minutes into the episode, or left over the episode, so I could probably... Oh god. Shum. Yeah, I could probably go do that stuff. Have you ever heard the lyrics to the Hirosaka song? It goes like this. Oh, good singing in a voice. Yep, this is a favorite thing to do. Actually, you know what? To hear a bit of curse, to see it even worse. The depths of Shibuya, it's where we all must cross. When, when you feel alone, down you must go. When you feel low down, you must go. Where the bottom lies a secret hidden world, but woe to thee who finds the entrance there. Where? For if you make it, you only meet despair. You only meet despair. Where? <clears throat> Sorry about that. You have to sing that while heading towards the center of the Shibuya Scramble intersection. For the legend of Shibuya Hirosaka to work. Um, pretty sure I heard some creepy bitch saying that, like, uh, 15 minutes ago. Shibuya is filled to the brim with hills no matter where you look. There's Konosaka, Masakaka, Arganzaka. Or you could say that Shibuya is like the valley for all of Tokyo. And I don't just mean geographically either. There's just so much information and energy that flows into it from all sides. And many thinks that's why Shibuya is so popular to begin with. Oh my god, dude, dude, dude. Hold up. Hold up, I got something else to say. Oh wait, guess I don't. Holy shit, bruh. Uh. Huh. Yeah, I thought there would have been more than like three of them around. Unless they're just in other parts of the thing. Hmm? Why am I wearing this main outfit? Because I have to get to work once we're done here. Or get back to work once we're done here. I came here because May really needed enough people to help out. I can't say I'm otherwise super eager about the whole thing. I mean, there was an actual girl who died doing this, you know. I know I met her earlier. Apparently she was doing everything you do for Shibuya Hirosaka and got hit by a truck right when she started crossing the street. I gotta hurry up and get this over with so I can leave already. Yeah, this honestly kind of makes me want to watch some fucking creepy ass horror anime or something. It's been forever since I watched a good ghost related anime. Uh, maybe I'll look one up just to watch while I'm letting shit render. Uh, 
there are five specific hills you have to use for Shibuya Hero Saka. Dojinzaka, Fukunomura Dori, Koan Dori, Miyamasu Zaka, and Meiju, Meiji Dori. Wait, that's not what the other dude said. You look at them on the map, they even form a pentagram. Wait, you mean you don't see that? Uh, Shibuya, the scramble intersection, a truck, and an accident. But woe to the you who finds the entrance there. Or if you make it. Alright, I've got everything all set up. Get all the club members together and take them over to Shibuya. I'll be giving commands from here. Meanwhile, I want you to join in and help perform the Shibuya Hirosaka as one of the five people. Gyoko, you realize I could die, right? Can everyone hear me? We're now going to commence verifying the legend of Shibuya Hirosaka. I've hacked into the cameras at the scramble intersection. I'll be watching you from here and giving you the commands as necessary. Keep your eyes and ears peeled and be ready for anything. Now, let's get started. You hear of it a curse to see it even worse. The depths of Shibuya. It's where we all must cross. You're doing great. Keep up that pace, Lily. Just speed up a little more. <sighs> when you feel alone, down you must go. When you feel alone, down you must go. Good, good. We're all about to reach the scramble crossing. The traffic light should cooperate, too. That being said, just in case, I went in and rigged it to work in our favor, too. So, just go ahead and cross. Not like any of you are going to hit, get hit by a truck or anything. <laughs> Fucking do it now. Just shuts them off and the cars go. At the bottom lies a secret hidden world, but woe to thee who finds the entrance there. For if you make it, you only meet despair. You only meet despair. Nani? Well, how did it go? We, we did it. We all made it here at the same time. Yeah, I guess we did it, huh? Yep, without a doubt. So, what now? What? Oh, what the? There's nobody here. Where'd everyone go? You're right. There aren't any cars around either. Looks like we've lost contact, too. Wait, what? what's that? Uh, guys, anybody else see that? Oh, my lord, duh. Right, well, we're gonna go talk to that creepy ghost girl in the next episode. Fan fucking tastic, right? If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, ring the bell, like Facebook, call Twitter, or Twitch, because I try and stream and upload every single day. And until next time, it's been the Boys of Gang. So, ta-ta for now. Peace.